Hi, this is uh, the second part of our rooms and our reptiles. Rooms and reptiles, we'll have another one about just rooms down in our basement. So here is the iguana. And he does not cooperate at all. As you can see, he's shedding. And he's being bad. Okay, so here's the green iguana. Me and my brother both believe that he is a, an El Salvador iguana. But he's probably a green. Um, they tend to go about four, five, even six feet long. Not inches, feet long. They tame, well, they... We'll have to have a custom cage made for them. Um, we right now he is in a fifty-five gallon uh, terrarium right now. It was a gift from one of my friends. He got this cage for me so I can have this iguana. This used to house a Chinese water Chinese dragon. Water dragon. Um, uh, Spike, I think is what his name was. Yeah, his name was Spike. Um, we're gonna name him Jurassic from Jurassic Park because he looks like a prehistoric giant. Anyway, um, right now he is housed in a 55 gallon cage with a 75 watt night bulb, a 75 day light bulb, and then a uh, UVB light. We don't know how many, we, it's about 10 watts, so yeah. Um, so the, so this is what kind of substrate they have, so. We have jungle bedding for this guy at the bottom, and at the very bottom we have newspaper. Super comfort. Um. And plus, it's easier to clean. Okay, this is what he has. He has... A custom-made hide. That I cut in. We have a water bowl that I need to clean out. Mm-hmm. And put water in. He ate we all his food log. today. We have... Drawers. Driftwood. We driftwood. We have another driftwood. Then we have, um... Leg... We have plants. And his least and his least favorite thing, the hammock. Oh, he loves this thing. He's been going on every day. Oh yeah, well I haven't seen him go on it, so Um Well he slept on there last night. Good. So apparently he doesn't want to go in right now. And there he goes onto his little hammock. Um so, Yeah, so he's housed in a fifty five gallon cage. Um, we are going to get a 30 gallon cage. We're going to put it down in this one. So, See. we're going to put them down. It's going to be down in this one. It's going to be we're the cleaning use, cage. We're going to use this for UVB. Hopefully, I can convince my mom. If I can get a blue tongue skink, hopefully, for me. Because the one at Pet Spice Plus, she's a beauty. Well, anyway, this is just another thing of rooms and reptiles. And also right here, my brother used to play for Springfield Blue Devils. If you faced them, they're not very good. And this is his second trophy, his first year trophy of football. I don't know the Devils logo on it. And you got to have Easter stuff. Yeah, and my cousins. Hey, let's tell you not this. Yeah, we're going to go downstairs now and show you what's down there. Uh, So, yeah, this was just Rooms and Reptiles. Well, we'll tune in for more later.